Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the International Dota 2 Championships. Five years ago, a tradition began that has changed the face of competitive gaming. The International, a tournament summoning the finest Dota teams from across the globe. Since its creation, much has changed. The crowds have grown from modest gatherings to a roaring sea of fans. To the map control from LGD as they can. Sumail up to another 1800 gold. Meanwhile, there's a bit of a chase onto Fear over towards the jungle, but no real follow up for this. Hope shot. There's the counter initiate. He's found out Yao. Can Yao make his way out of this one? The lift from MOI can toss him back. They won't touch him. Requiem's coming. No, not actually going to use it just yet. He gets thrown up in the air. He may be punished for BKB does this. They curse him and hold him in place. And Fear does the work even through this BKB. Finally gets up the mech. The first oh, the steal. Oh, with the plays, then the follow-up from Sylar. AUI will melt. It's a triple. Sylar turns it. BPD's next. MMY. MMY. Closing in on the opening racks here of your lower rank and finals. The Chow to goes in. Hook, then a fourth, but they set up on the Storm Spear. Can they chase them down? They get the water punch. See ya. There's the Laguna as well. A great call out from Sylar. Then the Vibe. It's a triple. Maybe. Racking up Bloodstone charges. Holding the line. And now on the fear. He'll drop as well. LCD pulling out the miracle. Oh, the Lotus Sword coming down as well. They're going to have to disengage. Oh, they were going to Omni slash that. But no way. Use the Lotus Orb indeed. Now he's shot back in. Resolution isolated from the team. Takes a soul assumption. Sonic Wave connects on Simon. He gets an Omni slash. Oh, the damage is on Oh, no. Oh, no. Just didn't quite find the ward. Please, as with the this rune. 
Okay, coming in, EG are gonna look to contest this. They, they don't have a gem available. MMI can just sit back and wait for the right opening to go, and the ropes is gonna fall. They've already gotten it, and they gauge up the high ground. They do fight jumping off the back here as the sun breaks up. They lose the Earth Shaker. Call it comes through. Sumail with the Yules, the winner's curse. Pretty good, but not enough to bring up Silo. They turn long for the Spirit Bomb, and they finished off the left track. They punch Fear. He's doing good physical damage here, but not enough to finish off the cores. They buy back on the Rubik. They chase on AUI. He's got the evasion that he needs to keep himself alive, but the familiars will be finished off. And PPD, the next man to be caught out by the buying fan of MMY. The Rains will miss. He glimmers. This is going to wear off momentarily, but he's juked them. He blinks away. PPD, a bit of a ninja. MMY does not want to let him escape for free. Even throwing out the earn charge. Remember, he just bought back. This could be a dieback for MMY. And he commits. He really commits for this cold embrace. He's being baited. Baited again and again. The ghost scepter about to wear off. Cores are coming in from behind. Maybe He's in deep, perhaps too deep. Has he been thrown to his own demise? No, he'll make it out. Silar also retreating. They're hunting. If Silar sticks around, he could be trapped. And in fact, this may be who is. He's got the Satanic now. He can pop it, fighting his way through. But the Blade Mail is going to prevent this. And now the TP start coming in. EG might get him twice. This Shadow Feed's in a lot of danger. We can fall down there. Maybe doesn't have it. He can't survive. He's a buyback Silar. Universe now also on the back foot of Silar. Walks away, they chase forward with Sumail, they look for more EG, finding the rhythm at the crucial hour. Shall we almost the dead? There's the chance out of the snowball, not enough! Sumail gets the kill, and now he looks to get out. BKB again forced the old man, punishing Silar, blinking in! Sumail going hard in the pain, he wants Silar, he gets him again! He always been saying to his mom and dad, let me do this, and one day I'll make you all proud of me and he's doing it, he's on his right path. The tools have expanded from a humble selection of heroes to over 100 potential gladiators. And with the help of the Dota community, each year the stakes have risen. Again and again, becoming the largest prize pool in eSports history. Once more, the time has come. From across the world, they have gathered. They have prepared. They are the best of the best. Some are veterans, warriors and victors of tournaments past. And others, ambitious newcomers, ready to prove themselves against revered champions. The eyes of the world now turn to Key Arena, eager to witness history firsthand, hungry to watch the war unfold. Who will emerge victorious? The battle. Ice, ice, he's down one, it's MMY, looks for the two hero cog pushback, but instead the tomb gets dropped, he finds nobody, maybe looking to turn this thing chain and isolate Ice, 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 who drops the cogs and is just gonna hang on for dear life, Remnant out available, maybe going in with auto text, Yell finally will fall here, the grave on Ice, 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 keeping him alive, they're forced to jump maybe back, but charging in is Silar, who pounds his way right through the dazzle that was on mid, now the call down, Blake Burrow from FY, where's that Epi, he doesn't have the clarity, but no mana, super, just taking it in the mouth, he can't hang on, FY, can he turn this? It's how who does. Makes it three. It's four. 1100 HP, and they couldn't burst through that, even though it was 4v1. FY didn't even get an opportunity, and the rocket got him. So many many ups in the first blood. He's just going to double ion shell and force Illidan back. And Illidan hasn't, doesn't have the region to deal with this. Uh, they got the silence on Psy. It will run out eventually, though. He'll get the surge. FNG. He's hoping to be able to get close enough for the Light Striker, right? They're actually still close enough for a cold arrows. Maybe FNG can land this one. He's going to turn around with a double ion shell. Go straight for Lil. He's going to be able to pick up the kill. Unbelievable play by Psy. And he's getting out. He held potions up, trying to dodge, turns around, and goes again. The FNG almost there gets the kill. Beach just want to back away this one, but Ice 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 goes in, looking for the cons, he doesn't pop them in time, he's surrounded by many, they get on the beautiful static, they pull it out there, cross one over the top, connects on two, Tyler Jaway holding their ground for now, as MMY has stolen the hook, he goes back in, but it's too late, it's 
fight. Already got nothing up. He hasn't finished off anyone yet, though. Only these backlight heroes maybe stands. And he looks to turn this. Has the chains available, but not the vision he needs. Every bit on Vici getting low aside for the Queen of Pain. Who is the healthy one that goes in first? Maybe Silence. Can they catch him out? This will be a huge takedown. He's kept alive. Glimmered back. Healed up. Survived. And now jumps double remnant away. But it's now getting the kills. And maybe it's Silar, the ones on the run. Now wants to go for it. He got him. Again, the pick. This might cost him. He's up high. Chains are there. No. The Arkin. Give this man a rampage. It's a rampage. God was kind of trapped there in the middle lane, but now, oop, there's the steep FNG. Gonna make sure that Kuro doesn't get out of this one. There's still the Snowball, though. Still a lot of potential for Kuro to maybe get out of this one. The Snowball's gonna delay his death, pulling it back. Kuro now trying to run himself away, but oops, are still there. Back him up three, and Echo Slam! There it is from Cubby with the Snowball on top! And VP quickly trying to retreat, but they've been caught. Lil Lugu to play, and last right click catches in Illidan. He's also running out of mana. Martiz, he's trying to pick up as many kills as possible. Illidan will end up going down, and Team Secret just wipes four right in front of their base. Just incredibly hard for him to turn around and just for uh, there's any more items on him. There we go. Charging in, but he's trying to take this one for themselves. He ain't getting low. Will he be able to get their spells off? He gets the weave up and the shallow grave. And they've killed Gravit. They've killed the Storm. And arguably, it's one of the heroes doing the best at the moment on the side of Newbie. It's up to Moon. He has stolen AC4 damage in this fight, but June needs to charge himself away. Actually, charging onto Forever. So MVP on six might be able to chase his. Oh, that's what done! Jerax with the Ravage! June is gonna go down as well. It's a double kill for MP, but none of the only ones are into the Radiant Agent. He's gonna get Frostbit enough, but he doesn't really oh, care. Well, maybe he will. Here. He jumps down. Where's that mana void? It will just end up killing a Garner if they stand next to each other, but the triple stun from Garner! He brings down Joe Wade! There's your mana void to a barrel strike to still Garner! He is alive! They go over on Yell! Three heroes down! Oh, seven gonna make the initiation here. Cloud Nine desperately need to win this fight. Oh, what a vacuum! With the Earth Booster on top! Unbelievable display of coordination from Beachy Gaming. Quickly win the fight. Three heroes down the Oh, the, the net! net! The net came out! Now it's MVP 
that are ready to look for more out of the basic complexity, of course. Nagat's the top set of racks. They're going to look for the second set. They have lost two sets of racks themselves, so this is going to make the playing board a little bit more even. So when the Melons can they do anything in March going forward, it's incredibly aggressive. He's a free guy forward. He's got his hit. He's on the Oh! Oh! He's getting all of them, and they're going to lose JP as well! Three here at 40 on MVP March to go... Itself, sorry, so Roshan, so Roshan. He oh, actually got the Roshan kill with the Sunstrike. Sun talking about the Hank being nice. I mean, if Anthony goes down... Right, so up this guy. They're going to try and light up the map, but can Ferev do enough of out the TA? I don't know if he can. He's actually getting chunked right here. This is, yeah, this is a very much more fire pot since the buyback has come out from the, uh, the TA. She does have pots, maybe they can turn it around with this buyback. Winter's got that oh, back. God. That is it, using now to refresh. Winter's got to move. This is huge. Huge. He's gonna go down almost the blood zone, he'll buy him some time for the lead of death, but he still dies. We're only trying to fight for it all, but now with the hook shot again, MP Ferev still alive, Rabbit and Banana in a lot of trouble. Banana, he's gonna go down, Rabbit the last one left alive for Newbie, triple kill for MP. Welcome to the official All-Star Game of TI5! Boy, are you in for a fun night. Ladies and gentlemen, Big Daddy No Tail and Chuan! Don't you think a real professional Dota player could manage 10 versus 10? Let's be honest, this is way too easy. Them fighting this. Or maybe you'll bring home the cheese, Chuan. I will eat the cheese. So you're probably wondering, where are the other 10 coming from? It's coming from out here! You. you guys excited? You look a little scared. Not very good. Shawi has your back. How confident are you in this team? You know, sitting next to Bendy. You wish it were Bendy. Isn't it? He's done for. What is it? I Seven versus like, one? Is, this is going to be like a 10 minute victory. Triple kill for Lucia. Oh, oh, oh poor puppy. Snowball suicide play. It's coming. Come on, come on, guys. Oh, it's yeah! That's an ultra kill. So Tim's just diving into tier two towers, and we've got nobody left alive. Oh, what a disaster this has turned into. Oh, right. Echo slam. Oh, no. That How did he miss? There's 10 heroes. Come on. Oh, Samael, don't do this, son. You're too young. Well, we're about to hit the 100th kill here for the side of Team Tron. Team Tron now pressuring the base. I oh, haven't got the suicide. Oh, no! It's my oh, Daisy, what? What? 33 minutes in, over 200 kills in this matchup. But Team No Tail, they're still on. Rapier's on the deck. Yeah! No! No! 17%! It's not happening to them. How? How can he not kill the ancient? We're going to kill him. Yes! Come on, Team No Tail. It could turn this as the biggest comeback. Where's your defense? Yes! Team No Tail win! Look at the comeback! Nobody has ever done that in the history of Dota! Wow! It is my honor and my privilege to present to you the great cheese. Too. But, oh man, I mean, that... this Lena's still in the grave for another 50 seconds. They can easily do it.
This is only Roche number two, though. If he goes straight for it. ROTK, does he go for it? I know he's manly, but how manly I charge Oh, he stole it! Oh, oh my god, he he's nice. Roshan has fallen to the race. C9, almost dead. They're collapsing in, though, this looks good. Oh, no, what's the oh, situation? Oh, 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 oh. He Double kicked four. four on a coil. The call down's gonna connect on four as well. Necro complexity, but it's not enough. Cloud9 finally finding the fight they've been looking for. Laguna Blade not gonna be enough for the kill either. It's a full five for nil exchange. The K's on Tiny really close to problems with the wrath. They're going for XC now, though. Big dive, the toss. He does mess up the stick. Then, no, no two, so just the three here on the K. Is it gonna be enough to save him? No, so he gets out. One more auto tech, they still can't kill him. F1 is committed for this, he doesn't have mana. XC gets the kill. He breaks out the IO, he's tangoing okay. through the trees. The K, oh, and he clobbers it for a double. Wing Kong resolution. Fire's gonna get you, wants to start the fight. Going in onto a low dance here, but only getting the decay zone. War's punch controlling Judah now, there's just good. Oh, the RP here! Oh the God. Sonic Wave is a triple kill, catching them all! Yoku with the blaze there. Who's gonna look for the TP now? Is he gonna be able to get He will be the only one escaping. Radiant structures are fortified.
I don't think Eevee are interested in contesting this war on five, but maybe they can delay it long enough for it to be five on five if they ice blast and fissure properly. There is no hook shot. They're all together. BBD, he got the ice blast ready for the dive! I'm excited about everything in my future, but I'm possibly more excited than anything else about winning TF5. TF5 is everything. You win this, you win everything. She is having power running for now. You have a free to turn. He's an excellent slam up. He doesn't look like a comeback. Call out aggressive. The call out. The perfect position. That's your record slam. Aggressive. Locked in position right now. He's going to embrace the fight with the wide of a few moving forward as well. DK about to drop. Aggressive is a full survivor. TDEC. It looks troublesome. It looks really, really bad for them. Aggressive on the run. Universal right behind him. They keep running out for GG. Well played. PG are your PI5 champion. Here in King Arena. They have managed to do it. Third place in 2014. It looked rough dropping down the lower bracket. They had to play the best of three and the best of five today. But they have persevered. And they will claim the Aegis of the Immortal. They are the champions here in front of their home crowd. They are the team that claim the glory, claim the huge prize pool, the largest one in the history of Dota 2. Ladies and gentlemen, the champions of the international Evil Geniuses!